Model Annette Picula intended to drive over the Arizona border with $134,000 in cocaine. Hi, I'm William Haynes. All right, Miss Annette, off the bat, this is Arizona. If you look mildly ethnic, you're gonna wanna be really careful in Arizona. If you look like you might have a relative that speaks something that's remotely similar to Spanish, you're gonna wanna drive right around Arizona, especially if you got drugs. If I had drugs in my car, I'd be driving like this. According to Daily News, she became overly talkative while at Border Patrol. That's where you messed up. Customs and Border Protection spokesman stated, Flirtation was what was going on. Okay, who talks like this? Are you one of the police officers that show up at the end of an episode of Scooby-Doo? It seems flirtation was going on. Thanks, meddling kids. Also, you can't flirt your way out of anything. I've learned that the hard way. One time an officer pulled me over and I thought I could get out of it, but apparently saying, Does there seem to be a problem, officer? Your ass looks great today. After they ask for your license or registration, doesn't work. The officers, after finding the situation suspicious, sent a border patrol sniffing dog and what's difficult about them is you cannot flirt with them they have canine brains they found 13 pounds of shrink wrapped cocaine totaling one hundred and thirty four thousand dollars miss piccola was born in mexico and had just earned her u.s citizenship in april let's pretend this piece of paper is your official document She's now at the mercy of the Federal Immigrations and Customs Enforcement. Moral of the story is, don't transport thousands of dollars worth of drugs, especially in Arizona. Do it in Florida. I don't think they have laws there. Likely, I think she was working with a bigger drug company, and I find it hard to believe that they did not set her up. They know what happens in Arizona. Arizona's border security is tighter than a on a hot Sunday, and you know that and that's just what I'm saying. So what do you guys think about this? Do you think she was set up? Do you think her citizenship should be revoked? Have you or anyone you know ever been treated unfairly by Border Patrol? Let me know in the comments down below. I'm William Haynes. Also, did you guys know we have a Facebook page? Go on to facebook.com slash sourcefednews and get our other stuff. Bye-bye. School is coming back and I know you hate it, but today we're gonna make backpacks for you to wear. Backpacks go on sale July 27th for $40. That's it? For a backpack? Really? May I introduce to you the world's best backpack. It's called the Backpack. Hackers can now hack into your car's computer system. It shouldn't surprise you.